Hello, uh, my name is Slav Hermanovich and I am a professor of environmental engineering at the University of California at Berkeley. Uh, I am here at the IWA Congress in Busan and would like to talk a little bit about an exciting project that we are now uh, carrying out in Berkeley together with my two faculty colleagues Professor Paz Gutierrez of Architecture and Professor Luke Lee of Bioengineering. Uh, the project itself involves uh, developing an innovative method for grey water reuse, reclamation and recovery that also includes uh, heat management. The idea was that in many places in the world, particularly places where you have a desert climate, you get significant variations of temperature between day and night and also in these areas water is relatively scarce. So uh, the idea was that if we can uh, utilize solar energy during the daytime to disinfect grey water and also to oxidize some of the organic material present in it using photocatalytic uh, processes, we can also capture heat in the water and then we can use both the reclaimed grey water and the heat stored in it at night, for example, for space heating or for uh, hot water supply. Uh, the uh, main idea here is, however, to apply this uh, process to tall buildings, particularly buildings that are architect architecturally complex. They have a interesting uh, undulated facades and uh, our idea was to use micro-optics to capture as much light on the vertical walls of such buildings. The typical story with the solar panels is that they are either put on the roof or in some other flat area and they have to be following sunlight for best uh, efficiency. Obviously, in a tall building, there's only a certain amount of space on the roof and that is typically not sufficient to uh, do all the reclamation and disinfection and heat capturing that is possible. So we thought about this as a system that is embedded in a facade. And uh, of course, the facade of a building is stationary, it cannot move with the sun. Uh, so we would like to uh, use uh, optics, especially developed for this, to capture solar energy. So uh, right now, in the process of developing a pilot-scale application, we have already completed some preliminary testing. Uh, we hope that this will be of interest to architects, construction companies, uh, water utilities, uh, that uh, can utilize this technology when it is ready, hopefully in uh, maybe a year and a half, uh, for, for this purpose. This uh, project is uh, funded by the National Science Foundation and we acknowledge uh, that funding. Uh, it's also a very interesting cross-disciplinary collaboration, talking between engineers and architects and uh, bioengineers and civil engineers and water engineers uh, is very stimulating and uh, a lot of fun. So uh, we have more information available if you are interested uh, either in potential applications or you have perhaps some good ideas or technology that you think would be useful, uh, feel free to contact me. Thank you.